In this tutorial, we're going to assign, well, make and then assign three simple diffuse materials in 3D Studio Max. I've launched the compact mode of the material editor, highlighted the first upper left slot, gave the material a unique name, SK1 Red. I now want to I use the diffuse color picker so that I can define my desired color. OK. I'll now do the same thing for the second color. It is going to be called SK2, or really, and that will be green. A little more saturation. And then we'll do this again for the final slate name. and the diffuse to launch the color selector or color picker. All right, so now that we've done that, we have defined three materials. We now to need to apply those materials to the geometry in our scene. I'll close the render window, select the first object, and then assign a material to it, thus the blue. But I had intended that the first sphere be red, so we'll go back, select the geometry, assign material to the object, repeat this for the red, the green, and then also the blue. Notice that once the material has been made and assigned to the scene, there are small triangles around each one of the slates in the material editor. Hit this to render, and now we have simple diffuse materials.